All the ammo used in this video was brought to you by Nosler, maker of the most innovative, most accurate, and most effective bullets and ammunition in the industry. <laughs> me to introduce the Hellcat Pro. I have a MacBook Pro, a Mac Pro, and I wrote the script to this video on my iPad Pro. And to this day, I still don't know what makes any of these products Pro. But I think that has more to do with my lack of Marquez Brownlee levels of tech knowledge more than anything else. That said, Springfield saw fit to give this version of the Hellcat the Pro designation. And just like my litany of Pro Mac products, when I got it, I didn't know what made this Hellcat a pro. And if I'm honest, I didn't care because the hyper consumer in me likes when companies throw the word pro on their products to make me feel special. I always thought the first Hellcat was a good looking gun, but its small size made it good looking in that cute with flashes of sexy Ariana Grande kind of way. The Hellcat Pro is slightly longer in the grip and barrel and the extra length makes the gun good looking in that sexy girl next door Victoria Justice kind of way. The Hellcat Pro is still chambered in 9mm. It still has the same 1 inch grip width, still has the same awesome iron sights with the tactical U-notch rear, it still has the same adaptive grip texture with borders that look like they were done with a pair of barber clippers. But the Hellcat Pro is different where it matters most, capacity. Instead of what is still an impressive 11 round capacity that the original Hellcat had, the Hellcat Pro has an equally impressive 15 round capacity. Even with a slightly longer grip, it's still effortlessly concealable while making it easier to grip and draw the gun without having to search for a little Ariana Grande size grip. I had this gun for about a week before shooting it. And in that time, I built it up to a level no gun could ever live up to. I love the looks, I love the proportions, I love the capacity, I love the ergonomics. But when I went to the range and shot it for the first time, uh, I was underwhelmed. I don't know what I wanted it to do, but it didn't do it. So I kept shooting and shooting and shooting. And then it hit me. This is a phenomenal concealed carry gun. And that's exactly what it's trying to be. Size-wise, it sits in a weird space where it isn't so small that it feels like a compromise, but not so big that it feels like a chore to carry. At the same time, when you're shooting it, it feels like a full-size gun. I initially wanted it to shoot like a race gun, but it's not a race gun. It's not even a dude gun. It's, I dare say, a professional concealed carry gun. The Hellcat Pro is a very deliberate gun. Nothing happens with this gun unless you decide to do it deliberately. And that's exactly what you want in a self-defense concealed carry gun. Take the trigger for instance. It's not silky smooth, it's progressively smooth. I can stop midway through the take up at any point before I hit the wall of the trigger. When I do hit the wall, it's a very firm wall, and then the trigger slides into a very deliberate and clean break. It's all controllable. The trigger makes me feel comfortable in that if I ever have to pull my gun and prep the trigger, I can do it confidently without worrying about accidentally letting a round off when I wasn't ready to. I can shoot this gun fast, but again, I have to be deliberate about it. Some guns I can just bounce off the trigger without even trying, which is fun when I'm at the range. But if I have to draw my gun in public and actually take a shot or shots, I wanna shoot fast because I decided to shoot fast and not because the trigger wants me to shoot fast. My Hellcat Pro came with Springfield's Wasp Optic, which if I didn't know any better, I'd swear Springfield was trolling me by naming this optic the Wasp, considering what happened when I did my first mag review on the original Hellcat. These stupid Wasp! Really? All right. I'm still not 100% on the pistol red dot train, but it doesn't matter because I have the option to use or not use it. And if I do decide to use the iron sights, I'll be just fine because I absolutely love the iron sights on this gun. The front sight is bright and grabs your attention like Ariana Grande had Bill Clinton's attention. 
The rear sight is this beautiful U-notch that gets out of the way and lets you focus on the front sight. Even the magazine release is epically deliberate. No matter the angle, when I push this magazine release, the magazine pops out like there's no such thing as gravity. When the original Hellcat came out, it was an impressive little thing and still is. But if you ask me, I think the Hellcat Pro was what the original Hellcat should have been. It's just a more cohesive gun. Yes, it's just a little bit longer in the grip and barrel, but that makes a big difference here. It makes the gun easier to get to when it's concealed. It makes it easier to shoot, not only fast, but accurately because the grip length and grip texture inspire so much confidence in the ergonomic department. I still don't know what the Pro means on my Mag products, but I feel confident in saying that I think I know what the Pro means on the Hellcat. It's a professional concealed carry gun because it gives you everything you want from a concealed carry gun straight out of the box. It's perfectly big enough while being perfectly small enough. It has great capacity, has great ergonomics, has great features that you can use or ignore, and it's not so high speed, low drag that it feels like the gun is dictating how you should shoot. I think it slaughters any other concealed carry focus gun in the Springfield lineup and gives other guns from other companies in its class an absolute run for their money. You know how frightening it is to think about what happens in the moments before, during, and even days after having to use your gun in self-defense? When you first start carrying a gun for protection, it can be a very scary and nerve-wracking experience, especially if you haven't gotten the education and training you need to feel confident. I've been there myself hoping I never have to go through a self-defense shooting, which is why I'm a member of the USCCA. As a USCCA member, you can eliminate some of the stress of carrying a gun for protection by accessing the amazing wealth of firearm education, training, and current state-specific gun laws of your state or states you may travel to. This can help you be prepared for or hopefully even avoid a self-defense incident. As a bonus, members automatically become insured on the self-defense liability insurance policy purchased by an issue to the USCCA. Click below to learn more. You know, we talk a lot about empowerment in this country, except for when it comes to the Second Amendment. However, I can't think of anything more empowering than having the most effective tool to protect you and your family. So help me spread this message by liking and sharing this video with everyone you know. And don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment because the Second Amendment, when it said militia, it wasn't talking about the government. It was talking about you. Also, if you want to know where to find the I'm the Militia shirt and merchandise, click the I'm the Militia link in the description section of this video. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And most importantly, make sure you hit that bell symbol.